this is Jill. Thank you for coming into my kitchen. I am making a super delicious, super easy applesauce snack cake. It's got lots of walnuts in it, it's got cinnamon in it, it's got apples in it, and it's just such a wonderful thing to have with a little cup of coffee in the afternoon. So let's get started. All right, let's get started with the dry ingredients first. Now what I have in here is some all-purpose flour. I usually use unbleached, un, uh, but you know, whatever you've got is great. Now I'm following my instructions here because I've got it all written down. I get forgetful anymore. So I'm going to put some uh, baking powder in here. That's three quarters of a teaspoon. And I'm going to put three quarters of a teaspoon of baking soda in here. And I'm going to put three and quarters of a teaspoon of salt in here. This is just kosher salt. If you were to use, uh, you know, like table salt, you'd want to just pinch back a little bit on it because it does, um, you know, it does condense down a little bit more. And then I'm going to add a good half a teaspoon of cinnamon. I might even hit it just a little harder than that. And then I'm going to add just a little bit of, actually, I'm, I made a terrible mistake that is not me. Oh my gosh. Oh, I can see there, if you're not watching what you're doing, all right, you can get in lots of trouble. So I'm going to start scraping some of that off. Oh gosh. You don't want that much of that make, do you? No. See, this is what happens when you cook, right? You make mistakes and you fix them. You know, Julia Child was really good at that really good at that. She could she could fix mistakes and I'm going to be taking a little bit of flour out of here but I don't think we're going to, I don't know, maybe we should just start over. What do you think of that? I think that's a good idea. So once I get my flour back in the bowl, we'll be back. Okay, guess what? We're back. All right, so that is the cinnamon in there. That is the cinnamon. And I'm going to put in just a little pinch. <laughs> don't you love it? I thought that was kind of fun. So there you go. So there's a little bit of nutmeg, right? So let me make sure I've got everything in there. I've got the salt, baking powder, baking soda, cinnamon, and nutmeg. And then I'm going to add a little bit of sugar. Usually sugar goes in with the wet, but this is kind of a little more on the drier side uh, recipe. So we're going to go with that. So here we go. We're mixing it up. Yes, here we are. Okay, now we're back on track, aren't we? Ah. All right, I'm going to set that aside. And we're going to bring in our liquids. So uh, I take a half a, it's a half a cup of applesauce, and I buy these, and I buy them really for cooking because a lot of times, you know, recipes do call for like a half a cup. And if I open a whole jar, I can freeze a, a, a remainder of a jar of applesauce. But these are a convenience item, you know, that I use. Okay, so that is a half a cup of applesauce. And then I've got a little water that's going in here. And I have some vinegar, a little white vinegar. That's going to give us that lift with the baking, baking soda. And then I've got some, vin, uh, some uh, <laughs> so flustered from that, uh, from that uh, nutmeg here. I've got two and a half teaspoons of vanilla. Actually, it's two and a quarter. That's two and a quarter. Okay. Got that in there. And then we're going to put a little oil in here. And yeah, we're just looking at about a quarter of a cup. I'll put some of that in there. Okay, there's our quarter cup. And I'm going to give this a good stir. Get that all mixed up. You know it's hard when you have water and uh, you know oil. You're not going to really get it fully mixed in, but you do as good as you can. Now you should have your oven uh, heating at 350 degrees with the rack in the center of your oven and then uh, an 8x8 big pan that's been oiled pretty well. You could use a eight by, you know, eight inch or nine inch cake pan, you know, round cake pan if you didn't have a square one. So now we're going to bring in the dry ingredients. There you are. Get that in. And we're going to give this a mix. And before that is totally 
mixed in. I'm going to add my walnuts because some of that flour will get on those walnuts and help them to stay in place. You know, they won't all fall to the bottom of the cake. So I'm just going to mix this until it's all uh, combined. You know, there's no more flour. And we're looking good there. So I'm going to bring in my pan. Yeah, here we are. Eight by eight. Nicely oiled. I don't think you're down far enough. Okay, there you are. Now you are. I'm going to put this in there. Mmm, I can smell all those wonderful ingredients. I smell the applesauce and I smell the cinnamon. And I guess what? I smell the nutmeg too. I get a little spatula here. Okay, that looks pretty clean. And I'm going to get my spoon out of here and I'm going to smooth this down. And then it's going to go into the oven. I'm going to give it about 20 minutes. And I will check it, I'll probably check it at about 18 to see how it's doing. And I'll put a toothpick in there to see if it's coming out clean. And if it does, that is done. And I will put it on a cooling rack. All right, that looks nicely smoothed out. I might do just a little bit more there before I put it in the oven. All right, I've got this all prepared, ready to go. And I'm going to put it in my oven and I am going to give it about 18 minutes and check it at that point. Well, hasn't this been kind of an exciting experiment this morning? Don't forget, always look at your spices. Good lesson, huh? All right, once this is baked off, I'll come back. I heard there was food. There it is. Some of his favorite stuff. This is the applesauce uh, snack cake. Now, you know, you can put a frosting on it, mm. but I don't think so. A little powdered sugar, maybe, but mm, it smells good. And of course, it's vegan. Of course. How else would it be, right? You want the first nope, bite? You know, you always take the first bite. How is that? How is that? Mm. Ooh. It's moist. Very, I can see that just from the... Nutty. Nutty. Mm. I could get behind that. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Cup of coffee. Mm -hmm. oh. mm. The apple is so... Very good. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. I like that. Very good. All right. Mm -hmm. That's great, isn't it? Mm -hmm. I'm going to go brew a cup of coffee. Well... You saw how easy it was, mm. even though I had that little thing happen. It's a great cake. It's moist. You could put like a cream cheese frosting on it, but I don't think so. Oh, I would. <laughs> anyway, thanks a lot for watching. I hope you tell your friends about this uh, channel. And if you're a vegan and you like vegan cooking, if you like product reviews, if you like whatever. A I hope smiley you, face. I hope you'll subscribe. Take care, everybody. Thanks a lot. Bye-bye.